All right, have you guys seen this? I am fascinated beyond fascination over this process. Uh, Padre player numbers transformed into art. I'm trying to read this while watching this and I can't concentrate on what I'm doing, Monica. Uh, the artist here is Monica Diaz, joining us this morning with her amazing Padres collection. Uh, good morning, Monica. Good morning. Nice to have you here. Thank you. Uh, I was just literally, I had my face buried in these paintings, trying to look closely at what it is. Explain the whole numbers thing. What are you talking about? Each, what? Explain it. <laughs> So I draw in strictly numbers or letters, and for this collection, I chose to make Padres portraits out of the numbers that they wear on their jersey. So literally everything you're seeing in these portraits, like this one of Jake Cronenworth. Yes. It's it made, was the nine. Yes. Over and over and over and over and over Exactly. And over. Yeah. So when you color in that jersey, it's the nine over and over on top of it. Exactly. Yes. How do you come... Is, how do you come up with that idea, that concept? <laughs> I mean, it's, I'm, I'm fa I, mean, I can't even talk. I'm fascinated by this. <laughs> so you're sitting there forever doing nine nine until you literally color it all in. Yes. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. So the idea for that where? Well, my art deals with. Uh, I actually draw with area codes, so I have a lot of hip hop inspired yeah. art where I use uh, area codes, and I wanted to do something special for the Padres, and I thought, well, I'll just use the jersey numbers. Brilliant. Just to make I mean, it similar. <laughs> here's how dumb I am. I, I'm talking to you yesterday. Uh, I'm emailing. I was like, hey, you know what you should do? You should make one of me and Shali. That'd be great. I'm like, yeah, because she can crank this out in 10 minutes. What a dummy. You must have thought, what a dummy, this guy, right? No. How, how long I didn't. does it take to, like, the Joe Musgrove, for example? How long? That seemed to have a lot of extra work because it's darker. I don't know. I mean, how long does that take? Yes, so the Joe Musgrove piece was probably the longest mm -hmm. um, because yeah, of all that of out. the. That was good. Yeah, because okay. all of the full in the jersey yeah um, that one took about 10 hours 10 hours yes you mentioned the folds in the jerseys because you need the shadowing and everything else that you're doing in there yes. with the numbers it makes it a little bit extra complicated right exactly yeah why do you challenge yourself as an artist with that extra level of difficulty on something like this I think we're so bombarded with art all the time mm -hmm. that I just really wanted to make something to kind of catch the eye and to yeah just perk the interest of somebody who's looking at my art. And you know, the closer that you get, like you just did, the more you realize yeah. what it is and you kind of have a certain appreciation for it. You can really get lost in each portrait. Yes, I do. And, <laughs> yeah, and, and, and as a fan of, of yours now and of <laughs> the Padres, you just, you look at a sleeve, you look at the belt, you look at the bat. It's like a different journey everywhere you look. It's yes. fascinating. The response from people, what's it been like for you? It's been amazing. Yeah. I mean, um, my followers got me onto Bally's a couple of days yeah. ago, so that was awesome. But just uh, art-wise, I've had followers for maybe about 10 years now that have just been consistently buying my yeah. art. So especially now with the Padres, I feel like I have a whole new um, audience that I can kind of talk to. You know, we'll, we'll shout out your cousin, Julian, because he's the one that, he, <laughs> he uh, what do the kids say? He, he dropped into my DMs or whatever. <laughs> yeah, so he DMs me with the link to the Bally's uh, Sports, the feature they did yeah. on you. Uh, and he's like, you got to check out my cousin Monica, what she's doing. Uh, and all your viewers, and Bally said, you know what, let's get all your Padres art. And they picked you, right? Yes. Uh, yeah. What was that like for you? Because now you have, all of a sudden, you have this big story on you. That was amazing. I've been making art ever since I yeah. could pick up a marker. So yeah. professionally, I've been doing this for maybe about 15 years. So oh. to finally get a feature like that and here is amazing, especially it's San Diego. This is now all of a sudden you're here and you're on the ballets, but you have <laughs> other stuff as well, right? Now, tell me some of your other pieces. You mentioned hip hop and, and what other stuff do you have? I do a little bit of everything. So mm -hmm. mostly on my website, you'll see a lot of hip hop inspired art, but um, I actually work on commission too. So I made paintings. Um, murals. I've yeah. designed a couple of beer cans as well, so I've done a little bit of a lot of Where things. Where have you been this whole time? Yeah. <laughs> you should have dropped into the DM or whatever years ago, Monica. Uh, the pop-up event that you have coming up where people can see this art and a lot more of it. Tell me where we can find you. Yeah, so on Saturday, August 6th, I'm mm -hmm. going to be at Machete Coffee House, which mm -hmm. is in National City from 9 to 12, and I'll be selling all of my Padres merchandise awesome. there. That is August 6th, so you know, you yes. get after the All-Star game and after yes. this weekend and boom, yeah. boom, boom. And I'm get... pretty sure we're playing the Dodgers that weekend, so Ooh. it'll be extra well, that'll celebration. Be, <laughs> get some of those Dodger fans in there, no, or not. <laughs> uh, this is fascinating. Uh, we love your work. We thank you for coming on here, and we're going to do a special shout-out. See, I didn't forget. I literally wrote it down with Sharpie <laughs> for Julian. 
A shout out to the Diaz and the Franco family. Uh, Mo Monica, uh, I'm fascinated, you know? Thank you. Uh, perhaps <laughs> maybe we can uh, get one of a couple days. How long do you think? What would you use? Would you use like five for us to make all the... Yeah, you know, kids, the five? <laughs> whatever you want. Whatever you want? I don't know. Fine. I don't, you don't need to do that. It's okay. Uh, I want to put this info again. You got to check her out. Saturday, August 6th. Uh, it is from 9 in the morning until noon at Machete. Huh? I yes. Said that. Machete Coffee on Highland Avenue in National City. You can find all of Monica's work, details about next month's event, all that. Fox5SanDiego.com. Click the scene on tap. Who you got tonight in the All-Star Game? Do you uh, want Juan Soto? <laughs> Who do you want the Padres to get as a pitcher? So many baseball questions. <laughs> You're a real fan. Yeah. <laughs> Appreciate that. Charlie, we'll get it back to you. All Take right. Care.